all parts operate as a system to make the drum brakes work. The master cylinder has two basic sections. One is a storage area called a reservoir for the fluid. The other section is a cylinder which contains a spool-shaped piston. Small holes are drilled through one rim of this piston. The cylinder also contains two sealing cups. a return spring, and an outlet check valve called a residual pressure valve with its own spring. A push rod transfers brake pedal action to the piston. The reservoir contains a supply of brake fluid. It's important to leave some space above the brake fluid to allow for expansion. Brake fluid must not be allowed to drain out of the reservoir completely because this will let air into the brake lines and we'll see what effect that has later. Your manual will tell you what the proper